Hey guys, today I'm going to share with you a home workout routine I filmed seven months ago. So that was back in August of last year when I was still um, staying in shape and preparing for getting myself ready for the upcoming swimming team trials at my university at the time. So this will be a more um, a less football specific but more swimmer specific workout but it's a still it's still a good sweat on nonetheless um, what with us all being stuck at home uh, during COVID nowadays so without further ado let's get into the workout to start things off I did some box jumps and box jumps are really good because they work under explosiveness which I cannot stress how important it is for all of you short distance swimmers out there um, the 50 meter races, the 100 meter races, these races are over before you know it. So working on your explosiveness helps you get off from the mark quicker, helps you get off from the start off from the blocks quicker, help, helps you um, when you turn and when you come off the wall, helps you get further off the walls. So um, it's really important. And the one swimmer who's really good at, at explosiveness uh, is of course the one and only Caleb Dressel because his starts are absolutely phenomenal. He, he leads almost half a body um, when he starts out from the blocks and that's because he works on so many of these in his training. And then I moved on to these um, squats and this is a harder version of the squat because I'm also raising my calves so if this is a calf raise mixed with a squat and you see my legs uh, down there at the bottom absolutely shaking because this is um, a lot tougher than it looks and uh, for each of these I do I do three three sets of ten reps for this exercise and with a five second hold in between each of the reps and try to bend your knees 90 degrees with your hips the general rule of thumb is to have your hips above your knees so you're not uh, you know you're not bending your knees too much and uh, after 10 of these, your legs will be absolutely um, shattered, just like mine are here. And then I moved on to an upper body exercise. These are pull-ups, and I'm just, just showing you this angle. Um, this is not the greatest angle, but uh, I just want to show you that my feet aren't touching the ground. Um, and I did 10 of these. I only did two sets uh, that day, but uh, I recommend everyone to go for three instead. That is a good uh, number to, to go for, three sets of 10. And um, it just works a, a, on a lot of the muscles in, uh, in the back, the triceps, um, the lats. So it's a very good upper body exercise. And then I moved on finally to these squat jumps. Again, these work on your explosiveness. and. There's actually even a video uh, of Caleb Dressel doing some tuck jumps, uh, which I'll be moving on to right here. So these are some a variation of the jumps, so not the squat jumps, but the tuck jumps. So there's a video of, actually of Caleb Dressel doing tuck jumps, and he can jump hella high. So that's what I'm trying to do here, just trying to really explode off the ground and jump, jump up as high as I can. And if you noticed, I actually just glanced up before I started doing these exercises. And the reason for that is uh, there's actually a lamp right above my head and there's a chance of myself, of me like smashing my head into the lamp because if I jump too high. But um, that's it for this workout. So just a few exercises here so you could perhaps have more ideas when it comes to working out at home. And the main point here really is to keep moving around, especially during times like these. And you never know when the competitions and everything, the training is, the, all the sports grounds, swimming, swimming pools are gonna open back up. So you don't wanna wait until those things are opened up again and then you start re getting ready by then. You wanna start getting ready now. Stay ready, be prepared at all times. So be prepared at, way before an opportunity comes by. So when the chance really does come, you, you can make sure you take advantage of it and grab hold of that chance. So that's it for this video. Drop a like if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you want more. And until my next one, I will see you guys later.